hats off to Kentucky's Horse Industry Day is a celebration of the horse and its impact on the state of Kentucky. And it's happening this Saturday with a lot of fun family activities and a $50,000 Grand Prix show jumping competition. Our Jane Davenport is live right now at the Kentucky Horse Park to give us a preview for the event. How's it going, Jane? Lisa, it's going great. I'm so excited. We're just two days away from Hats Off Day, Kentucky. And as you were saying, this is a day to celebrate and recognize the importance of horses here in the great state of Kentucky. And what better way to celebrate than with the biggest horse at Kentucky Horse Park. This is Jace. He is massive. For reference, I'm 5'2". And I have Andy here to tell me more about Jace. Andy, how, how tall is Jace? Chase measures in at 19.1, so if you were to work that out into uh, inches or feet, that's six foot five. My goodness, that so. is crazy. And tell me a little bit about Jace. He's a draft horse. So yes, he is a draft horse. He's a Belgium, which uh, obviously that name implies they originated in the country of Belgium. Um, but they are usually the most massive and uh, heavily muscled of the draft horse breeds. That is incredible, and we're going to see more of these draft horses for Hats Off Day. So I'm coming over here. This is Dr. Woodrow Friend, and we have Lee Carter over here. He's the president of Kentucky Horse Park. They're going to tell us more about the event today. Guys, let's get started. What can people expect? Well, thanks for having us, Jane. So to start off, this was implemented by Dr. Tom Riddle in 2003 as a way for us to recognize the horse industry, to give back to the community, but look at the long-standing relationship that the horse has had with Kentuckians in the past, present, and future. Uh, these draft horses were the mainstay work animal of Kentuckians when they first came to Kentucky. Uh, we want to make sure that they're recognized. Everybody can come set their hands on them, see them, but I also want to make sure this is our heritage. Uh, people can come see these animals. They're what built Kentucky. Absolutely. And so with these draft horses, what else are we going to see for Hats Off Day? Yeah, so the park is open all day, so guests can come out. The afternoon, you know, Hats Off Day activities start around 3 o'clock. Uh, and then we'll end up with a Grand Prix. So you won't see Jace out there jumping any okay. of the standards. We'll have different <laughs> horses for that. Uh, but there's pony rides, there's inflatables, there's uh, things for everybody to do on Saturday. So this is a family fun event, so you can bring anyone. Anyone can come to this. Anybody can come, and it's completely free. Central Bank has sponsored admission, so the entire park is available to everybody all day. It's so exciting. Okay, well, thank you guys for telling us more about this event. We're going to have more information on this, continual coverage on this, because this is a very exciting day. And as I'm sure all of you guys know, horses are a very important part of the state of Kentucky. Well, thank you guys again. And one last shot here over at Jace. You guys can say goodbye to him. He is huge. I'm going to go hang out with him for a little bit, but I'll head it back to you in the studio. Jane Davenport, ABC 36 News Now.